I'm Sarah Marlowe, and I started with First Dakota on July 2, 2012. I've been at the main location working in compliance the whole time. I love compliance. I like to do the research. I like when people call me and need a research project and need me to find what needs to be done. Compliance is a lot of rules and regulations, and we got to make sure people follow them. And sometimes it's very hectic and very stressful. She's our in-house attorney. She is an attorney by trade, and so that has brought a wealth of value to our team. She researches like no other. She has a law degree also, so she can look at and comprehend much better than some people some of the regulations, because to the average person, it's like, well, it's a wall of text, but she knows what she's looking for, which is very helpful. I do have a law degree, so it kind of helps with reading the rules and regulations. It kind of fits into my educational background. She's very much a team player. If there's something that needs to be done, she's more than willing to jump in. If one of us in the compliance department has a lot going on, she's willing to pick up the slack somewhere else so that we can maybe focus on a, a more uh, higher priority. I have two big dogs, Paul and Toby, and I love to walk them. And I like to read, I read lots of books, and I like to work in my yard. I haven't met the dogs, but I know about the dogs, and she walks the dogs quite a bit. They're her second set of children, I think. They are her pride and joy. She does everything for those dogs, just like she would for any of us here at work. She adopted them from Heartland Humane Society, which is wonderful. I jokingly sometimes say that she doesn't have just three sons, she has five because currently she has two male dogs and, and they are like family. Well, one of her old dogs she had um, did not like my husband in his police uniform. I really like Michael Connolly, Harry Bosch, the Lincoln Lawyer series. Yeah, I've read, I'm getting close to reading almost all his now. Action, investigation, it's about you know, murder cases, court cases, how they put them all together. She's not loud, but she laughs a lot. And yes, she's very nice and she's very outgoing. Diligent sounds too boring. That's not quite right. But she's, she's very diligent about helping someone. If they call for help, she'll make sure they get what they need. And no one's, she doesn't ever leave anyone hanging if they've come to her for help. She's caring. She's a mother hen. If there's anybody in the bank who's having, you know, difficulties, maybe fighting illness or something along that lines, she's the first one to ask how things are doing. She's the first one to uh, maybe see if we can do a fundraiser or set something up to support them. Sarah has the most giving, supportive spirit ever. You know, her, her main goal in life is to help people succeed. If you're in her circle, She's, she knows what's going on in your life and she cares about what's going on in your life. I hope they say that I'm helpful and that I'm friendly when I'm working with them and that I make their jobs easier because I would never want to make their jobs harder. I was raising my kids and working and it worked well with my schedule and I like the people I work with. The thing about First Dakota and the longevity of our employees is a lot about the culture of First Dakota, and First Dakota wants you to succeed. And Sarah thrives in that environment where she is helping people and she has support to succeed. And so I think that was just a magical combination, First Dakota and Sarah, to bring her here for 10 years, and hopefully maybe 10 more. I would like to thank First Dakota for allowing me to be on their team for the past 10 years and for a few years more. <laughs>